Paul. Tom McLean and Captain Harris in Plymouth. Thank you both very much indeed. Thank you. Thank you. Well, a look at tonight's headlines. One policeman has died, two others are in hospital, and three people are missing after a sea rescue went tragically wrong at Blackpool this afternoon. The siege of Parkhurst Prison has ended this afternoon when two prisoners released the assistant governor they'd been holding hostage. As we told you earlier, the Foreign Secretary, Mr Pym, has called off his planned trip to the Middle East, and the Warsaw Pact leaders have put forward what they call a grand new peace proposal following their summit in Prague. Sue? And that's it for tonight. Tomorrow in Nationwide, we shall be launching our Rock and Pop Awards for 1982. That's the records from last year. We'll be inviting you to vote in the best single and the best group. So join us tomorrow. Meanwhile, from the, me and Tom McLean, Richard Kershaw, somewhere over there. Good night. A word now about Welsh programmes on S4C this evening. At 5 to 7, Gairni Breed, an opportunity for learners to widen their vocabulary. The news is at 7 o'clock, followed at 7.30 by Llofa, when various aspects of Wales's folk traditions are discussed. The panellists tonight are Geraint Jenkins, Roy Sayre and David Roberts. Heather Jones, Arhuntus, Battlefield Band and Boys of the Loch provide folk music at 8 o'clock in Torthavara, which comes from Llanberis Folk Club. A Bidar Bedwar at 8.45 looks at world events in a Welsh perspective. Those programmes are on S4C tonight. Later here on BBC Wales, Sports Night beginning at 10.45 is extended to include at around midnight live coverage from Sydney of the crucial first two-hour session on the fourth day of the fifth test match between England and Australia. Sport Night's, Sports Night starts at 10.45. Well, in about 25 minutes at 10 past 7, Celtic Road. But first, Doctor Who.